Hey, what's up, guys? Temporary Hero here. Yesterday on Destiny's Instagram, they released photos of all the Year 1 exotics that are going to be coming over to Year 2. In the weekly update that they posted on the 19th, they were saying that we are going to get be getting two exclusive Year 2 exotics, which I'm kind of hoping that it's the Void and Solar Thunderlords, because... Thunderlord is the first exotic I ever got. It's badass. But we're going to be getting a bunch of year one weapons and armor back. Some of you might be excited, some of you might not. But we're going to go over armor first. So for the Hunter, we're getting Bones of AO, which allows you to get triple jump. Um, or an extra jump, so if you're using triple jump on Gunslinger, you get four jumps. I like these boots, they're pretty badass. Also for the Hunter, for the Helmet, we're getting... Uh, Ecleophage symbiotes never really used it. I never actually even got it, so I that would explain why I never used it. But I never got it. Titans or the Hunter is pretty much my secondary character. The Titans pretty much I never play as him because uh, I don't really like the Titan. Sorry, Titan players. Uh, we're also getting Radiant Dance Machines for the Hunter. These are all coming in December, and I believe that is it. No, we are getting ATS slash eight. Tar Tarantella, which is a year two exotic that's finally getting released in December. And that is it for the Hunter. For the Titan, you're getting the Armament uh, Armamentarium, which was a year one. It was also showed up in the Armory as saying it was a year two, but it never popped up. No one ever got it. I know one of my buddies places the Titan, loves this armor piece, never got it. And now it's actually coming back to year two. Also, the Titans are getting Peregrine Greaves, which I believe allows you to shoulder charge while you're in the air. Maybe that's what it looks like. No, you can always shoulder charge in the air. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, I don't really know what it does. I never really use the Titan, so I never even look into what the Titan armor does. Um, we're also getting Twilight Garrison for the Titans. It was another year two exotic that just never got released, just like all those Hunter ones, or Warlock ones, and Hunter ones. Um, and for the Warlock, you're getting nothing manacles, which gives you an extra scatter grenade, also your scatter grenades track, which can absolutely destroy people. Also getting Apothis Veil, which doesn't really do much, but... It's badass looking, makes you look like an Orient aspect, which I think is pretty cool. Um, and that's it for armor pieces. As for weapons, we are getting quite a multi tool. I'm excited. I just started getting into scout rifles. And it's got third eye on it, which your radar stays active while you're aiming down the sights, which is hands down one of the best perks you can get for a weapon, especially in PvP. So that gun's going to be a beast again. Also, we are getting Dragon's Breath, which Dragon's Breath is pretty much useless. So yay. Uh, Plan C is coming back. We are also getting Super Good Advice. I don't really know anyone who ever used Super Good Advice, but Super Good Advice is coming back. Also, we are getting No Land Beyond, which for you No Land Beyond players, you should be excited. I've seen videos people absolutely destroy with this gun. So. That's kind of cool that they're bringing that back. It's definitely an interesting looking gun, and it's probably the most one of the most different sniper rifles in the entire game. Uh, it's really cool. I'm excited that that's coming back, even though I'm awful with it. Also, hard light's coming back. I don't know why hard light is coming back. I mean, no one ever really used hard light. I mean, there were a few PvP players who used it. Uh, that week before Taken King came out, people were absolutely all over that gun. And it was ripping through people, but it's coming to year two. And all of these exotics are getting new perks in their perk tree, which I'm kind of curious as to what they're going to get. Um, but I hope you like this video. And go ahead and go over to uh, Destiny's Instagram. You can check them all out. They don't say what any of their new perks are going to be. But. They're all coming out in December. There's also going to be a weapons patch in December. Hopefully we get some new quests and some new stories. Uh, I'm going to be talking about in the next couple days what the Refer a Friend quest is. I'm not. I'm kind of worried about that because it looks like it's kind of the whole like 
internet or cable TV thing where, hey, if you refer a friend, you get $100. And Bungie, if you do that, I'll be so upset at you. But let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about all these guns and armor in the comments below. Also, if you want to talk about or have any predictions about what some of their new perks and their perks are going to be, let me know. But I hope you guys liked this video, and if you did, go ahead and leave it a like. I would love you forever. Otherwise, I will see you guys later. Peace out, Girl Scout. Goodbye.